Oh my goodness. I can't believe we found an enchanted golden apple. This has got to be the most prized possession in the Omega Kingdom. So I get confused about whether calling this place Omega Kingdom or Fort Java, to be honest. Why, hello there, and welcome back to Fort Java, Omega Kingdom Rises. What is going on, everybody? I am Mr. Unprofessional, and I gotta say, you guys have missed a little bit of the play in this world so far. There, Yeah, there's been a lot of developments, in, including, but not limited to, these beautiful things. Look at those beauties shine. Yes, that's right. We have ourselves some wings, and we have ourselves a totem of undying yeah there's a lot going on <laughs> there's a lot going on welcome back like i said if you happen to miss the last episode there's a playlist upper right hand corner of your screen don't forget to click on that and come right on back so you don't miss a single bit of the action so first and foremost i'd like to take you back to how we got the wings it wasn't too much of excitement but at the same time we searched and searched and searched for what seemed like forever and we finally got ourselves a pair of wings i honestly thought that the ship had been raided already when we got there but it wasn't so yes, wings. Very nice. There's a few other things that has happened here. And uh, yeah, let me show you that right now. It kind of includes, as you may have seen in the opening scene there, this piece of awesomeness right there. Yeah, um, yeah, we found that and I couldn't believe my eyes, to be honest with you. But we do have it and I feel like that makes us the most powerful being in the kingdom. May maybe not, but it, it, it should do something. <laughs> it probably goes without said that we're on a server, but if we click tab, you'll see that we have zero deaths. So those are death counts, and there are a few people on the server left with zero deaths, and I want to keep it that way. Yes, big plan, big plan. We're practicing for hardcore. If you follow us on this channel, you know that we are no good at hardcore. So anyways, now that we're all caught up, we have some work to do. In this episode, we have a few things to do. We are going to lay out our base, at least the beginning stages of our base. And if we take a look up here in this sky, you will see there is the, I think they call it an ob obelisk? Oh, I almost died. And uh, I want to incorporate that somehow in our build, but I didn't exactly like this area here for the build. So what I've decided is we're going to make a path that goes up Bridges across here. Oh, okay. Bridges across there and uh, then tunnels right through the mountain over to this side over here and then spits it out right over through here. Brings it down and around and into this area right here where the mine that we found uh, where, oh goodness, where we found that enchanted apple. That's, that's the goal. Yes, that's the goal. So, oh. There's one more thing I wanted to show you guys. Uh, let me light up this area really quickly. So while we were exploring, we found this little piece of jewelry right here, along with this guy, that guy, and this guy. That is a lot of bling. <laughs> so my question to you, and leave it in the comment section, if you guys have an opinion about this, should we do something about these four connected spawners? That is the question. Yeah, I found them while I was exploring down here, you know, when we found the enchanted golden apple, and I don't know if or what, I should do about it. So leave it in the comment section if you think we should do something uh, or if we shouldn't. Which brings us to our next thing. We've done a little bit of work smelting up this nether brick and what we're gonna do is we're gonna continue a path from the nether hub. Uh, I'll show you real quick. So this is our nether hub. Uh, very simple, very, uh, you know, primitive. <laughs> There's nothing really going on here. No plans on this part yet. The only plan I have is if you come down here, you will notice that there is cobblestone and there is nether brick right there. And if you go further over there, you can see it from here. There's uh, fences that are made of the nether brick also. So I think the plan, the preliminary plan, is going to be to continue this path. Oh, okay, there's a ghast. That's, those guys scare the heck out of me. Did he drop a tear? No. No, he didn't. Like I was saying, we're going to continue this path all the way to our base entrance. And honestly, if we have enough materials, we could probably go all the way to the end. Oh, this is... Oh, my goodness. Oh, somebody... Oh, wow. What in the world? Are, 
Are all of them? All of them are now like that. Oh, this wasn't like this last night. Who has done this? The night elves have gifted us with an amazing door. Oh, that is epic. I don't think we'll make that. Oh, I broke it. There we go. Wait. Uh-oh. I broke it. Seriously, this time. Uh-huh. Okay. I didn't mean to break it. It broke itself, I swear. Oh, man. I really did break it. Uh-oh. Great. Uh... Mm. Oh! It fits itself. What in the heck is going on? Does it... Does it have a timer? <gasps> it does have a timer! Oh, that's really cool. This place is awesome. Okay, anyways, if we would stop getting distracted... Uh, man, I gotta figure out a door like that. That's really cool. And the fact that it's on a timer? Oh, so cool. So cool. Okay, so maybe an entrance like this. You know what? We're gonna do that. Um, so we have a reference. But I think what we're gonna do is do something like that at the entrance here. Yes, uh, maybe we'll make this like wider. Not really sure what's gonna happen on the sides or walls, but wouldn't that be cool right here? I think that would be pretty cool right there. And like I said, this part right here, no idea. No idea whatsoever, but uh, that's plan number two for the day. And it's raining, that's that's awesome. As for part number three of today's, okay. Uh, this world's trying to kill us, apparently. Let's get rid of this rain, shall we? Like I was saying, as for part number three, we have a dragon fight. Now I know what you're thinking, but you just fought one last episode. Well, we didn't exactly do much. <laughs> we did travel there, we did get there, we did see the dragon, we, we even shot at the dragon. <laughs> but I doubt we even hit the dragon once. So, like I have done with other things, I've done a bunch of work off camera, and... If okay, where is it at? Is it here? And No. What the heck did I put it? Well, apparently I've lost what I'm looking for. Where... Oh, man. Oh, here it is. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> As you can see... I knew that I knew where this was all the time. Okay, so we have collected some wool, you know, for the for the path, for the for the setting up thing, and we have some end crystals. Now, if you guys remember, all we need to do is put these end crystals around the portal, and we can resummon the dragon, which is totally allowed on the server. Now, I'm gonna keep this up because I'm gonna put this stuff away really quick. All right. Long-winded way of telling you what we're going to do for today's episode. So we're going to get right to work. And I think the first thing we're going to do, we're going to grab all this wool. Uh, maybe the paths will be a nice bright color. Maybe, oh, I need to put this stuff away. Hang on a second. Okay, so we're going to grab all our wool. We're going to pick green for our first color. And we're going to do this real simple like. We're going to start off as this being our number one thing. And we're actually going to make a path. What is the best path? possibility here hmm let me think let me think what we could do is make a path oh green's gonna blend isn't it can you see that give me a second let me look you can't really see that okay we're not gonna pick green the the grass is green what was i thinking maybe blue will stand up a little better okay so path right through there okay and then we're gonna go right above there uh-huh and we're gonna cross into this hill right here obviously there needs to be some terraforming maybe we'll go right in there right there yes uh-huh uh-huh i wish i could put one in the middle there but you see you see what i'm getting at right maybe hold on a second we'll get some dirt on second thought we'll get netherrack and voila you have yourselves a path into the mountain great step number one now as for this path we have to make a path over to that area right there because that's where our nether portal is unless we move the nether portal but i don't know not really sure what's going to happen with the nether portal but we need to figure a path well i guess maybe we should figure that out first shouldn't we <laughs> okay maybe uh-huh maybe we take it down further here okay so let me let me look let me look let's look together shall we so the path comes through there 
comes out probably right around here. Oh no. Uh-oh. This is this is uh-oh. This is really not good. Oh my goodness, I was about to die. Okay, like I was saying, comes out about here and then comes down and about, yes. We're gonna have to make a nice pretty path. Comes out to here, keeps going, keeps on going. And then down to about here where it takes a curve over to this area. I hear the zombie, but I don't see the zombie. Let's take a look. I think that might work. The only thing I'd probably change here is we're gonna go out a little bit further here. Maybe come down this way and then curve back. Yeah, just like that. Okay, let's get rid of these. All right, let's take another look. Oh, that's perfect. That's exactly what I was thinking. Very nice. Okay, now I'm thinking too, what if we were to make a separate path, but to where? Where are we gonna possibly put this nether portal? There's another ravine right there. Oh, I think that one's just water. Let's check this. Yeah, this one's just water. Okay. Uh huh. Not really liking any of it. Unless we put it maybe here? We can maybe put it here. Yeah, maybe make a separate path coming this way. Hmm, you know, I think I've, I'm seeing, I'm envisioning here, I'm envisioning. Okay, so I'm thinking, I saw this little ravine right here. I think what we're going to do is going to split this off. We're going to go this way, right through here. I'm going to keep going down and around this way. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And it'll lead us right, right to it, right there. Let's take a look. Oh, I like it. Yeah, that works. Oh, you know what? You know what we could do? Uh-oh. Do we have... We don't have lava, do we? You know what I'm gonna do? You, sir, are going down there. The rest of you are leaving right now. Oh, we have a fighter. <laughs> hey, man. I spared your life. You ought to be f grateful. How about you get... How about you get over there, buddy? If anybody's looking for that guy, he's... He's in that hole. Okay, now, what I was thinking was we could possibly put that portal, like, in the middle of this hole right here. Yeah. But, like, floating. And then we could expand this hole and make it all ominous looking. I think that sounds like a cool idea. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to continue this path. Uh, we could make it cut up, yes. Okay, so we'll continue this through here. Come right out through here. And then we will float on over let's get some of these blocks here okay all right all right maybe we'll put that there i feel like this is about the middle maybe middle ish middle ish and what we'll do we're gonna get some different kind of wool here something like that i'm liking it yeah i think it'd be centered a little better and with the hole getting bigger oh man I like it. I even like the path leading up to it. This is going to be epic. All right. I think that is part number one complete. We have ourselves a path that we like leading into the areas of interest. As far as the path goes, that's going to be a different episode. We have a lot going on this episode, but at least we have an idea as to what is going to happen here on this base. So cool. We're going to put some materials away. We're going to go into the nether and we're going to start on the next project, which is taking care of that nether tunnel situation yes phase one complete oh yeah by the way we have shaders on <laughs> for pretty much this whole series so curious does it bother you do you like it do you not like it let me know in the comment section and uh i'm pretty sure i like them but i'm curious if you do so make sure to let me know moving on oh i forgot cobblestone okay uh phase two uh postponement <laughs> All right, cobblestone check. Let's get to work. I think the way we're going to do this is a quick little time lapse. So I'll roll the clip and I'll see you on the other side. Hey there, post editing me here. So we've had a little bit of an issue with the replay mod and we won't be able to do the time lapse that we talked about in the previous clip. So yeah, sorry for the technical difficulties and uh, we're moving on. Okay, are you guys ready? Look at this beauty. It's nice, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so pretty much it's kind of a replica from that but on this side with our own little touch to it we've added this here all right 
and uh, we've continued this path and this entrance and we've made the walls. I'm not really sure what I think about the deep slate situation there, but um yeah we're keeping it for now we also alternated lamps every 10 or so blocks and uh yeah this is what it looks like i think it turned out pretty good it took me a little while to get uh you know deep slate i didn't have any deep slate and to smelt up all of the brick that took a little while yeah and let's just mess things up here i also did the top with slabs so that that looks complete there and i think it looks okay i think it looks pretty good i think it goes along with the uh, whole theme here in the omega server or the omega kingdom not server fort java server but if we go in here i i did the deep slate yeah the Deep slate. Oh, you know, he used cracked deep slate there. Maybe we'll have to go back and, and change it for cracked. But yeah, we went with the blackstone and the brick and the deep slate to kind of continue on the theme all the way down this bridge slash entrance to our nether tunnel. So I think eventually I would like to go all the way down. See, I got about this far with the materials that I had uh, path wise, but I, yeah, this doing this whole path with that design is going to take forever. So I just decided to, um, um, yeah, use up the materials that I had and uh, we'll do the walls later on. Um, yeah, that, that's where we're at. So here we go is our entrance. No idea what's going to happen here. And uh, I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. <laughs> oh, there's a there's a hoglin. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm, awesome. Oh, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Like I was saying, stage two was purely to get this hallway done, to get this portion of the hallway. Um, yeah, and as you can see, I only went a little past my area here, but I think we're going to, I think that's going to work for now. Stage two, I am going to count as complete, even though part of stage two was going to be to reposition this uh, nether portal and get this area ready for, you know, the new setup. But yeah, we're not going to do that today. We're going to move right along to stage three. Now, what is stage three, you might ask? Why, well, I'll tell you. We are going to go to the end and fight the dragon. Yes, that is what we are going to do. We interrupt your regularly scheduled programming to bring you a special event. Mad, 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 <laughs> sorry mad, I can never say your name, has invited us to at least take a look at the raid arena. We are going to see that for the first time and possibly be involved in, in some, you know, slicing and dicing. So yes, let's go do that and then we'll go fight the dragon. I'm excited. And here we go. Raid time. We don't know how it works yet. We'll find out momentarily. Matt is still explaining to his audience on stream. By the way, twitch.com. Mad, Mad Gregoric. Mad Gregoric. Yes, I, I know how to say that word. Go check him out. And um, yeah, wish us luck. Hope we don't die. Zero deaths. We're, we're going to keep our zero deaths. Yeah, right? Right. Of course, right. Mr. Professional. Yes. Over here, please, sir. All right. Okay, so what you're going to do, you'll, you're going to drop down this hole. Don't move anywhere after you drop down. Okay. And then when we say we're all ready, you're going to run forward, run towards the bubble column. You'll be on a block. You'll drop down one block. As soon as you drop down that block is when the raid will start. You'll see the raid bar at the top of your screen. All right. So, you go ahead and drop down, but don't move when you get down to the bottom. Got it. You'll see what I'm talking about. You're standing on a block. It's a drop down of one, and then you'll see the bubble column. Okay. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, I see it. So we're all going to go over here and get in the middle. All right. Off the plate and coming back up. Raid bar initiated. Okay, everybody watch platform over here because it's going to be all seven waves at once. So be prepared. Oh, boy. There's one. There's two. There's three. There's four. Oh, <laughs> oh that's epic. They're actually all coming right, after us this oh, time. No. <laughs> <Texas>. <laughs> they're all after mad. Yeah, yeah, they're after somebody. Run, 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 run. run. Not, oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, oh, look at all the Johnnies. Oh, oh goodness. Run, 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 run. run. Oh, there's run, a witch. Run, run, <laughs> run, 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 Matt, run. <laughs> oh. I can't hit oh. anything. <laughs> oh, there's everywhere. They're everywhere. I got vexes flying at me. So many vexes. <gasps> uh. I know there's vexes everywhere. Go, guys, run. Okay, I need to eat. I need to eat. Eat mad. Eat. Oh, right. man. Wait, That's it. I think they're, they're gone. I right. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, let me get him. <gasps> I got a vex I got a vex Nice. Yes. You're <laughs> still so angry. About that. <gasps> oh, I got there's one coming after you. Oh, it died. You got an arrow right in the middle of your head, Psych. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, I'm, I'm doing perfectly fine. I do not have brain damage whatsoever. <laughs> well, none of again? us died. That was good. That was awesome. That was awesome. Did we all get a vex head? 
Uh, I got, let's I got see. two normal ones. I got a pillager's head, and I got an angry vex head. Ah. Hey, duh. Oh, look at this. I forgot we put those on. Ah. <laughs> It's a very angry Vex. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, not I'm a Ravager. Oh, no, the Ravager. <laughs> the three angry Vexes against the Ravager. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, hey, whoa. That was fun. Oh, that was a good time. That was a good time. Wow. That was a lot of fun. And we didn't die. Can you believe it? Because I kind of can't, <laughs> to be honest with you. Look at this. Zero. That is a good thing. That is the magic number. Nice. Now, hopefully we don't die fighting the dragon. So, phase three initiated. Oh, we need a couple things first, though. I'll meet you at the base. All right, I just need to grab these end crystals here. And off to the end we go. That should be everything we need to fight the dragon. And here we go. Here we are in the end. And uh, if you haven't seen this... Oh, goodness. There's already a dragon head right there. That's kind of cool. Okay. Oh, no. No, no, no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Come at me, bro. Come at me. All right. Now all we need to do is one there, one here, one over here, and one right there. We should be able to respawn the dragon. And, uh, oh, I only have five rockets, so that's cool. Um, uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is, this is, okay. I can do this. I can do this. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. We're, we're recharging those. All right. Now here comes the dragon. I've never done this before, you guys. So this is, this is quite exciting. Where's he at? There he is. Ooh. Okay. Dragon time. Oh, come on. There we go. There's one. Oh, you know, I have rockets. Just knock those out really quickly. Let's see if we can do this in 15 minutes or less. <laughs> what do you guys think? Can we do it? All right. We're so close. We're just going to come in here. Hopefully this doesn't kill us. All right. And we should have one more. Oh, goodness. Wow, he flung me far. <laughs> All right, we can do this. We can do this. Oh, goodness. That took a lot out of me. Now, where are you, dragon? Okay. All right. Leave me alone. It looks like someone's helping us. Not sure who that is. What? Oh, this Enderman is being annoying. Enderman, leave me alone. Great, now there's a bunch of Endermen after me. I'm missing the whole dragon fight. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> this is horrible. Okay, dragon? Where's the dragon at? Come on now. We're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. Oh, final hit. Yes, we did it. <laughs> nice. Oh, and they're still after me. Where's that water? No idea. Oh, here's my water right here. <laughs> I gotta get rid of these freaking Endermen, man. Leave me alone. All right. <laughs> Victory! <laughs> we did it. Dragon defeated. Phase three complete. And there you go, folks. We have the completion of another episode. Uh, you know, the impromptu raid thing was pretty epic. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. We got ourselves a Vex head and a Ravager head, and we had fun on the server with a few of our server mates. Thank you so much for the fun. Uh, that was that was a lot of fun. <laughs> That was a lot of fun. And we defeated the dragon. Sort of by ourselves. The side came along and decided to help us. But we also got the layout done. And we got our nether tunnel semi-completed. It's been a lot of fun this episode. I am not going to lie. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much for coming and thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy the content, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. There is a notification bell that lets you guys know when we post so that you don't miss a single episode. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, you know, a big thanks. I recently, if you know you know, I recently put up a welcome video on the page. If you haven't subscribed, go check that out. Um, yeah, I'll put a link to it in case you want to watch it anyways. But I put a welcome video and the reception on the video has been pretty amazing pretty amazing. We've actually, at the time of this recording, we're able to reach over a hundred subscribers, and that is a huge milestone for us. Super thanks. A lot of thanks. All the thanks. Thank you so much. I appreciate the support. And that's it for us. Enjoy the rest of your day, everybody, and we'll see you in the next video. Have a good one, everybody. Bye.